Now, I'm gonna talk about the shitty other shit that I was talking about. I'm gonna break it down into two videos. Dose, dose upload. Basically, Halo Infinite introduced this new thing called the Battle Clash. Now, you're fucking stupid. Let me explain that a Battle Pass is a linear progression system that games will implement into their titles to encourage continued um, playtime with their shitty platform. They had this in the Master Chief Collection, and um, I guess they brought it over to uh, Infinite. Now, this is okay. I'm okay with Battle Passes, actually. I'm, I'm, I'm totally fine with it. But um, the progression, the way the progression works in Infinite is that you have to do these things called challenges. Now, that wouldn't be so bad if these challenges weren't fucking bugged out the ass. They suck. You know, some of the challenges require you to use the shittiest gun in the game that you can't fucking kill the wildlife with. You know? But, I mean, it's the only way to level up, so you gotta... Well, you can't even fucking do it because it's bugged, you know? There's, there's, there's like a thing you can get for doing all the weekly challenges, and I'm trying to get it. I really am. But those motherfuckers gave me a bugged-ass quest, man. Like, it won't even work. It's so, it's so horrible. Shit is good. I've read up a little in regards to the uh, battle pass. And it doesn't sound like they're going to fix it. They're going to keep it shitty. I don't know why. Maybe they uh, maybe they don't like money. Maybe they hate their players. Maybe we did something to piss them off. But um, it doesn't sound like help is coming. So I can't even get the thing that I want to get. It's like this visor color that looks gold and I really want it. And I've only got like, what, five quests left to do? And I'm stuck with these three that I can't even fucking do. There's a lot of shit missing from the game. Weapons, armor, it's it's new, right? So it, it's, it's like excusable, right? Huh? Yeah, that, that would be the normal, you know, mindset in this scenario. But let me tell you, motherfucker put a put a fucking gameplay hint in the loading screen talking about wraiths. And I haven't even seen a fucking wraith yet. I've got like maybe more than 14 hours logged into this fucking game. And, and, and you're giving me hints about wraiths. And I haven't seen a single fucking wraith. I haven't even seen a fucking, um, <coughs> a fucking, what to call it? Scorpion. <coughs> Fuck. Motherfuckers put wasps in their games. They forgot to add the tanks. What the fuck? Fucking serious? Why? 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 Why the fuck did you do that? I don't know, man. I think they should have just kept working on um, the campaign and then develop the multiplayer side by side. But they 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 released it early, and it's fucking horrible. And you know what really grinds my gears? It's that, despite the fact that this game is so underdeveloped and so shit right now, they have the audacity to put a fucking battle pass into the fucking game. And that upsets me because I can't fucking do the battle pass. Because the game, the, the, the shit's literally bugged. It's literally bugged. The fuck am I supposed to do? I can't even do this shit properly. And you want me to do a battle pass. You want me to spend my money to do a battle pass that I can't even fucking complete? Because your game is fucking broken? What? Really? Really? <laughs> You're gonna sell me on that? That that's your that's your that's your sales pitch. Okay. Fucking dumbass. You're not uh No. I haven't actually bought it yet, because I'm not that fucking stupid. But to the people that bought it, this is this is from 343. This is directly from the 343 headquarters. You know what this is? Fuck you. 
<laughs> that's what that is. Go fuck yourself. You know, because you're not getting your money back. Knowing, knowing the Microsoft uh, store team, the support team, you're not getting your money back. Fuck you. Eat shit. Die. And uh, go, go buy a PlayStation. <laughs> but uh, all the veterans out there, you know, the fucking 3,000 IQ motherfuckers like me, the Mega Minds out there, big fucking five heads. Stay strong. Don't buy that shit. Unfortunately, it seems like I'm gonna have to miss out on some content because these incompetent fucking losers don't know what the fuck they're doing. But unfortunately, that seems to be the case. The game is free. So if you'd like to go try it out for yourself, I don't recommend it. I have never been more fucking angry in my life than playing Halo. And usually when I when I get angry, it's because I'm bad at a video game, right? I'm like, oh fuck, oh shit, you know? But I've played Halo and you know, there have been times where I'm like, oh, I could have done this different or I could have done that. but. You're, you're gonna have so many people coming up from fucking behind you, you know? Th these motherfuckers got me thinking that I walked past something really interesting because people keep spawning behind me. People are always fucking behind me for some reason. And you could just be like, oh, you're just not being attentive. You Do you think I'm looking at a fucking wall 24-7? You know, thinking that, like, uh, I'm... Oh, fuck, that thing got really close. Burn, motherfucker. Fear my fire, you fucking homo. Okay, he, he crawled away. Get the fuck out of here. Anyways, uh, what was I saying? I'm not staring at a fucking wall the whole fucking game, wondering where everyone is, okay? I'm walking around, but these people are spawning, like, directly behind my ass. And then, like, the sensitivity is so shit. If you get shot from behind, don't even bother trying to turn around or do anything. There's no cover for you to hide behind. You're dead, okay? If you get shot from behind, you're dead. There's nothing you can fucking do, okay? Trust me. The, the, you know, you're, the only thing you're gonna do is ruin your fucking controller by trying to look around. It's it's ridiculous. You just put the fucking things down and respawn. If you're lucky, you'll spawn behind some dumbass and get a free kill. Because that motherfucker's not gonna be able to turn around in time. But you know, whatever. Um, in the time that I've played, the maps that I've been on, it seems that weapons are specific to maps, so it's not like randomized. They've got these things. I don't know why the fuck they did this. I really don't know why the fuck they did this. 20 years, 20 fucking years, 20 for fucking 20 years. They just put weapons in a crate or like it would just spawn on the ground or like lean to get like propped up on like a wall or some shit. For 20 years they did that and it was fine. It worked. No one gave a shit. But Halo 5, Halo, I'm sorry, Halo Infinite was like, you know what, fuck that. That's fucking stupid. We're smart. We're, we're very intelligent. We're above that. Let's build these complex little locker things that hold weapons and show the respawn timers for like the shit on the map. Let's do that. As a matter of fact, Let's, uh, let's do that for everything, for everything, for the cars, for the, uh, the grenades, everything, the gear, everything, just do it, fuck it, who gives, who gives a shit, um, so they do that, right, all around the map, weapons are specific, you know, and they spawn in these little locker things that have timers on them, as I've stated, now, I, I wouldn't give a shit, but, the thing about it is that if someone grabs the weapon from that locker, you're not allowed to get that weapon even if the respawn timer's up. That motherfucker has to die and then the weapon has to despawn. So not only does this asshole have to die, the asshole that's carrying the weapon you want, he has to die. Uh, you have to hope and pray that the motherfucker that killed him doesn't just pick up the weapon immediately, All right? So it's like, you, you'll spend half the game waiting at a fucking shit you know there, there's been seconds around like okay do i just sit here and wait i mean this, the timer's almost done and it's a good gun 
the, you know, despite the fact that all the guns in this game fucking suck, this gun is slightly better. Um, only to find that the asshole across the map on my team is holding that weapon and has yet to die because he's been sitting in a corner for five minutes, you know? Thank you. Thank you for that. Three, four, three. You fucking, you fools. How are you for doing that? Yeah, guys. This is a fucking problem. This game is so shit. It has a shit start, right? But that, you know, you could argue, oh, it just came out. They're going to change it. They're not going to fucking change the locker system, dude. They're not going to add a fucking evasion system. They're not going to add shit to the map. That shit's done. They might make new maps, but there's still going to be shitty maps in the pool. A lot of shitty maps in the pool, actually. A lot of shitty weapons in the arsenal. A lot of shitty things are going to stay in the game because that's how it came out. Because this is how they're releasing it. I doubt they're going to change. They're very solid on this fact. The game will stay shit. It will continue to be shit down the line. It will continue to be slightly less shit in the future. Hopefully. But it's still going to be shit. These, this is in the core game. This is the foundation they've given themselves. And it sucks. Really bad. It's an open beta, so it's subject to change, you could argue. But I mean, like, come on. Come on, this is 343. Three. Come on. They've got to work on making shitty armor in some stupid fucking battle pass that doesn't work so they can get money. It's not their job to provide a fun and interactive experience to the user. It's to get as much fucking dinero as they can. You, you, you think about that. Next time you're like, you know what sucks? I really want to like this game, but I can't because it sucks. I'm not going to praise a game for being shitty. I'll play it. I'm not going to fucking like it. I'm going to let everyone know how shitty it is. I'm going to urge them not to play it. Ultimately, I'm shooting myself in the foot. But I mean... I don't know how else to get a message out there. These motherfuckers aren't going to listen. They're, they're, they're literally not listening to the community. As a matter of fact, their community is so fucking brain dead. They are praising these people. They are worshipping these people like gods. For shitting on this franchise. They're like, yes. This is so fun. <laughs> I, I can't even say that without without <laughs> without it sounding ironic <laughs> oh man the, these motherfuckers man if th that's fun are you fucking serious I'm telling you man we, we're living in a clown world just just make a, a clown battle pass and have me pl play as fucking have me play as a, a fucking a jester or some shit It's fun. You're having fun? That's not right. What the hell? Change the game. You're ridiculous. I'd also like to point out that cosmetic wise, I think I mentioned this earlier, but cosmetic wise, I don't know what, where the fuck they're going. With their art direction, they got fucking samurais and shit now. It's creative, it's cool. Sure, I support it. But I wish you would focus on the fundamentals of your game. And building something to stand on before you start trying to siphon the money from my pocket. You know what I mean? At least make the game fun and playable. Before you start trying to shill, shill me some fucking bullshit about um, a helmet. I'm like a pair of boots. If you want to play it, go ahead. Let me know what you think. I think it fucking sucks. I think I've made that point very clear. But I mean... 
trust me get get a couple hours in and then come back to me actually play 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 like halo i want to say reach but try playing five and reach okay play play reach because that was bungee and then you'll see okay yeah this is you know this is this, this fucking slaps man this is fucking awesome It's fucking tight, bro. And then play five, and you'll be like, okay. I can work with it. I, I can I can fuck with it. You know? And then play infinite. And then if you're still alive and you haven't shot yourself in the fucking head, come back here and let me know about your experience. And we could talk about it. Yeah. But remember, remember what I told you. The guns suck ass. Don't forget. Movement is slow. You'll notice it because you'll spend half the fucking match walking around, waddling from point A to point B. Only to be shot in the back because remember, sensitivity fucking sucks. If you're on controller, if you're on Xbox at least. And you know, you, you let, let's say you forgive it. Well, but don't forget this little detail. The respawn points are ass too. What's that? You found a nice shiny gun? Oh, you fucking idiot. That's a water pistol. You're gonna die. Because someone with... Someone went on a walk with his boyfriend and they, they found you and now they're gonna butt fuck you with their, uh, their little assault rifle and kill you and you're gonna die. <laughs> okay? And then you're like, okay, whatever. At least I got my challenge done. Oh, wait. No, I didn't, because the shit didn't register. Why? Because the game's fucking broken. And it's bugged. And then you're like, oh, 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 geez. Oh, well. Uh, let me check my progression on the battle pass. And then you look at it, and you see all the, the cool, fancy shit on it. And you're like, oh, darn. Oh, well. Fuck it. But I guess I'll just roll over and die. Yeah. That's how it is, man. This game is so fucking shit. It's honestly impressive. Hey, do we have an award at E3 for shittiest game developed? Hmm. Cause I think I, I think I know a pretty good contender to pull its own weight in that category. Pretty shit. Pretty fucking shit. I haven't played Vanguard yet, but trust me. Fucking, I'm sure throwing stones could be more entertaining than this bullshit. But I mean. Seriously, play Halo Reach if you have it. Play Halo 5 if you have it. Let me know what you think. Cry Infinite, come back here. Uh, and let me know what you think. If, if I come up with anything else to tell you about how much it sucks, I will. Um, and don't expect too many videos from me. Uh, I really just got fucking mad as shit. And I was like, you know what? I need, I need to like, I need to let this shit out, man. This shit got me shaking. This shit got me fucking, this shit got me fucked up, bro. This shit got me fucked up, dog. Bro, you see this shit, man? It's ridiculous. Um, but I mean, I, I think I've said all I gotta say. Uh, I'll praise the game a little bit. Actually, I don't got anything good to say. It's fucking, it's that fucking bad. I can't think of anything right now off the top of my head. It's so fucking shit. Um, let me think. Uh. The armor's kind, not even, dude. This shit looks stupid. Well, the armor... Shows promise, I guess. Cosmetic wise. It's not so, it's not looking so good right now, but uh, shows promise. I really, I, I don't know, man. I don't want the game to suck. I want it to be successful to some extent, but fuck man, just work on Halo 6. 
just do something else. Fucking 